In spite of years of research on the ideal row width and plant density, this topic is still open for discussion because there are so many factors involved. In the past, the ideal was to have some canopy closure as soon as possible in order to control weeds. But with the arrival of Roundup Ready cultivars, weeds can be controlled very effectively in wider rows. Factors like plant structure, disease pressure, rainfall and climate all contribute to the decisions one must make. Recent research on plant density and row width shows that narrow rows outyield wider rows, especially when cultivars with an upright structure type are used. It seems now that plant density plays a much bigger role than row width, with certain cultivars preferring lower and others higher populations. Cultivars with an upright structure can deal better with plant densities higher than 400,000 plants per hectare in narrow rows than bushy types. On the other hand, bushy types can perform well in narrow as well as wide row widths at plant densities below 400,000, even as low as 220,000 plants per hectare. Certain bushy type cultivars can be planted in 76 cm rows with a plant density as low as 220,000 plants per hectare, while others can be planted up to 400,000 plants per hectare in 50 cm rows. Upright type cultivars can be planted at a density of 350,000 plants per hectare in 76 cm rows and up to 450,000 and more in 50 cm rows. With an upright cultivar, plant soybeans under irrigation at a density of 400,000 and more plants per hectare in 25 to 38 cm rows. With a bushy type cultivar, plant 300,000 plants per hectare in 50 cm rows. 